seat belt mounts down here and there used to be a threaded bolt that went right through here that is broken loose and it's actually broken around the side here. I'm going to have to cut this and get that out and then re-weld this and restructure that place where it comes to sleep. The seat belt has a little pin in the back of it that goes through this hole right here. a bolt right down here where my finger is and uh, I'm going to wind up welding a bolt through that hole and then re-welding this whole structure to the floor bolt right here. So the first thing I've got to do is cut this and get that bolt out of there. And what I'm going to do is cut it with an hammer. Okay then, I got that spot chiseled out. It's kind of big and ugly but I can bend that back into place. I also got the uh, the piece that the original seat belt bolted into, which I think, if I could save it, put a new bolt in there, and actually weld that back in place, that would actually be my best application. And what I've done is I've, I've taken me a little bit of penetrating oil, and uh, I've got it soaking around here. This actually was turning a little bit before it uh, snapped off. I had welded something onto here. It had a little movement there before it broke. I'm thinking probably my best bet would be to put that right in the vise over here, and then uh, just kind of gently tap it one way and the other and see if I can loosen it up. Give it a try. Well, it ain't moving much, and you know what? It might be easier to fabricate up a different, uh, a different one. Put something new up in there. Right. Go look in my metal bin and see what I got. Uh, pretty much all you need is a nut and a bolt about the right size. Just attach it to. Uh, piece of plate weld it up in there. I got I got a parcel of nuts and bolts over here. I expect I can find something workable. Expect I can.